Hi, I'm John Holden. Welcome to Earth. Hi, I'm John Holden, and welcome to Earth. We're starting off our show here in the heart of Spain, in the ancient city of Toledo. You know, the city is still known as the Imperial City of Spain. And at one time, it was the capital of the Spanish Empire. Today, as you can see, it still protects its legacy and heritage and history, but especially it protects its legacy of growing grapes sustainably, as you're about to see. Located on a hill overlooking the winding Tahoe River, much like a moat surrounding an ancient castle, Toledo is a true sight to see as the cultural capital of central Spain. This medieval water wheel arch, a few miles outside this venerable city, was once part of its ancient culture. Built in the 14th century, it was integral to grape growing. Grape growers have been uh, here. We have found evidence since 14th and 15th century. Uh, so they've been, they, they have been here for ages. Hundreds of years. Yeah, growing hundreds grapes. of years. <laughs> <laughs> Making the same as we as we do nowadays. Thanks to this water wheel, they could irrigate the the vineyard. So we stand today in, at the same place. This history is very important to Imperador Group to preserve because it's a symbol of the sustainability, of the, the preservation of our history and our traditions. That grape growing tradition continues today in the Imperador's Dera Mazas vineyard, where winemaking embraces both sustainable tradition and the most modern viticulture practices. Emperador, as the largest brandy producer in the world, we have a responsibility to our global consumers to deliver world-class products to them while sustaining the environment for the future. The heritage of centuries-old traditions are enhanced with modern, innovative technologies that look after the land and the natural environment around us. It begins in the Imperador's Dera Maza's vineyard near the ancient city of Toledo, where the grapes are ripened to perfection. Its grapes are grown in Spain because of the optimal climate and local winemaking traditions. Brandy starts here with the grapes that we, we grow here. We care of all the process from the vine to the bottling plant and to the clients and suppliers. We measure everything and we try to improve in all our processes and the result is a very high quality products and respectful with a nature, environment and people. The aged brandies travel to the gateway to Asia, to the Philippines. Here is where Emperador Brandy, available in 62 countries, is produced. The result, brandy of the highest quality. Emperador believes that its success entails the latest innovations that lead to preservation and sustainability of its surroundings. It's important to say that we make exactly the same product as our ancestors, but with the new technology. We make it more efficient. All the inputs we use for the vineyard are just the inputs the, the vines need and no more and no less. So we maximize the, the yield and the production of the, of the vineyard in a sustainable way. That includes soil humidity and salinity sensors monitored by technicians, an aeration system in the irrigation pond to micro-oxygenate the water, and smart sprayers to carefully adjust each dose of irrigation water and fertilizer, as well as high-flying drones to carefully inspect the hundreds of acres of vineyard. That sustainable battle includes fighting against bird pests that eat the grapes with the ancient art of falconry. This is Saranjo. He was 
born in this vineyard four months ago and he knows the vineyard pretty well and he certainly knows how to keep the pests out. It's the same technique as uh, our ancestors uh, used and we, we like to, to grow up our own falcons in our vineyard uh, so that they live here and we can uh, keep all the bird pests away from the, from the grapes. Imperador's sustainability efforts aren't short term, they're generational and its vineyards are woven into the fabric of this historic region. Its equal focus on making quality spirits, legacy and protecting the environment allows such exquisite foods as these to be grown and nurtured. The result? A glass that lets us celebrate life's special occasions while taking care of this good earth. Cheers!